Hello everybody and welcome back to Animal Crossing City Folk! We're gonna start the day as we start every day by watering our turnip. Now, I, I'm gonna go back to buying flowers every day because I really want to build up a flower garden because I, I miss our flower garden and all of our, our fancy pink flowers. Um, I actually forget, did I buy flowers yesterday? I did. Nope, I hit, I, hit, I hit plant. Plant them. There we go. The pansies look so much better in this game. <laughs> uh, everything looks better in this compared comparatively. Hey, Gabby. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah, Steven. Woohoo, honey bun. Yikes, Steven. I just saw this totally weirdo. This total weirdo hanging out on the bridge. He was just all like looking at the water, like he was thinking deep thoughts or whatever. So I was like, hi, and he was like, dude. And I was like, eek, so I ran away. Okay. So we have a weird guy hanging out on one of our bridges. Okay. So I think we only have the one bridge. Also, I apologize if you hear animals or walking in the background. That, that would be people upstairs. Because I can't put off recording anymore. Um... Okay, well, it's not here. Oh, hello, Steven. How are you doing today? The flea market is coming up this weekend, Snook. I still have to get my house in order. I don't know what I'll want to keep and what I'll want to sell. What if I accidentally sold my prized postcard collection, Snook? I'm sure you won't. I mean, I don't see how you could accidentally sell something, so... You know. another bridge in the town. Oh, well, there's this here. Now, I do know where there's a fossil, um, because I saw it during the opening bit thing. Uh, it's Amelia's house. Sorry, guys, I would talk to you, but, well, I, I don't want to forget where this was. Where's his house? Uh, no, I, I need to... Um... Oh, I wasn't down far enough. Okay. There's a fossil in front of Tank's house. Well, fossil or gyroid. It could be either of them. It was raining in the city yesterday. Survey says a gyroid. A mega fitzoid. <laughs> Why is it always gyroids? Part of me almost wants to not visit the city that often, in case it rains. Here we go. This is Pascal. Man, breathing air feels pretty good. Hey, can I share something with you? Okay. If lightning never strikes twice, how do you explain twins, man? Whoa, now I'm freaked out. Right on. Um, have fun, Pascal. <laughs> Pascal is a weird one. Um, that, that's basically the only way to describe him, is he is a weird one. Now, Nooks is closed for renovations today, so we can't sell anything today. Um, so really, we have no way of making money today, really. I think... I'm gonna go check town. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to Tank here. Yo, Steven, dude, it's so nice out. I gotta get some rays. Kapow! So you know how some people show their faces around here only during special events, right? Well, I heard basically they're all total buds of the mayor. Kapow! Getting pros like that to visit for free? Whoa. Only the mayor has got connections like that. Pretty sure they just come around. If, you know. 
The, new, the next game in the series taught me anything. Hello there, Steven. I'm glad to see you're gracing us with your fine presence, cuz. What? You think it's strange that I have a shovel? Well, fossils aren't about to dig themselves up now, are they, cuz? I think that means there's a fossil nearby, whenever an animal says something like that. Wait, clovers. They're so hard to see. I'm, I basically just have to watch for, like, the black outline. Wait, there's something. That's, oop, someone's... Oop, I, darn it! I, I missed butting in on their conversation. By accidentally hitting tank with my shovel. I am bad when it comes to using the pointer to do things. Um, let's dig this up. What's this? Fossil! Yes! We have a fossil today! Get this nice and buried again, just so the hole isn't in the way. You know, where we don't really have a whole lot to do today, I think I'm gonna do the money rock bill on screen. I'm gonna, at some point, oh, it's right here. I'm gonna, at some point, um, uh, start cutting this out. Okay, this is someone told me I can't get the other bag of money with my regular shovel. So, that's a thing. I'm guessing I need the golden shovel. Or maybe the silver if it's been added? I don't know when the silver items were added. But, I mean, we still get 8,000 bells. So, I mean, we still have a decent chunk of change. Um, I just have to remember that we can't really... If we do fishing today, we can't sell anything. Because Nook's here is, well... Currently remodeling. Please come again later. It'll be done remodeling tomorrow, I believe. Oh, there's another thing. I just actually hit a tree with the shovel. Another gyroid! A bowtoid. Okay. Hmm. Well, we might as well talk to, uh, Felicity. Woohoo, Steven! Say, Steven, you have a camera and stuff, don't you? Cameras are crazy easy to use. You just have to press 1 to take an awesome picture. And then you can press 2 to see your pi the pictures you took. It's so, like, if you see any trendy boys in the city, totally snap a picture for me, okay? <laughs> yeah, that is the thing. We can just push 2 to see... Um... Oh! But I thought we had pictures. I could swear... Oh, I have to manually come in here and save that. Oh, I did not know that. Hey, Amelia. So, I heard that you're totally picky eater. Is that true, Mimi? So what if I am? I don't see how that's any business of yours, cuz. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I just thought... Cuz I'm kind of picky too, and so I thought maybe... N never mind. Oh, stop whining, and for the record, I'm not picky. I'm just trying to eat healthier and avoid sweets. What? So you can't, like, eat pound cake? Or yogurt parfait? Or frozen yogurt? Stop! Don't say any more, cuz. Too late. Now I'm depressed. Aww. At least it looked like Felicity was trying to give her a hug after to be like, Oh no, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Blavis, I know you're a night owl. Um, donation for you. I do want to check out the auction house today. Because I forget the date they said. So, please identify it. This is Stego Tail. Cool. Wait, don't we also have the Stego Torso or something? Yep, that's everything, Blavis. I have to check. Uh, I know Bugs was the one b above Brewster's Cafe. Hi. Hello, Brewster. I am here for coffee. It's my blend. Surprise me. Got it. Here you go. House blend. Brewed with natural spring water.
There you go. Fresh brew. Drink it while it's hot. Thank you. Ah. Now that is satisfying. I feel like I've been bathing in coffee beans. <laughs> that doesn't sound pleasant. Does sound like something Shadow the Hedgehog would do. I mean, he does apparently just eat the coffee beans raw, so I mean, you know. Okay, so I know that way is bugs. That way was fish. So what's here? Fossils! Sweet. Yeah, we had the stego torso. So now we need the stego's head and we'll be done our stego. Oh, there's so many dinosaurs this time. At least I think. Feels like there's more. The iguanodon. This is the... something. Oh, this is the T-Rex. I was expecting that to be bigger, but I guess it's really high up and that's why. Oh, there's a second floor? Oh, it's for like viewing down and there's also- Oh, this is where these are. So there's our ammonite. And we can run down here. Yeah, there definitely feels like there's more fossils to find. But I'm sure we're gonna find all of them. I mean, I don't know when this series is going to end, but I want to set the same goal I had for Wild World of completing the museum. Not sure if that task is even possible, but I want to do it. So at some point, I'm gonna have to catch the spider and the nighttime summer creatures, um, which are just absolutely terrifying. Oh, these two are talking again. Amelia, it seems like you're always going on vacations and stuff. So, of all the places you've ever been, which was the best? They're not vacations, they're, they're holidays. But yes, I suppose I do travel quite a bit. I guess my favorite was the time I traveled down to the Lake Frofro Resort and Spa. Only the most hip and fashionable people are even allowed near its front door. Wow, that's awesome! But I thought you didn't like to get all tan and leathery and stuff. Yes, but that's why I wear sunglasses and a beautiful hot cost couture sun hat, cuz. Tee tee. Oh my gosh, you must look like a total weirdo. <laughs> Aww. What and what? What would you know about it, little Miss Plebeian? Perhaps you'll be able to understand these things when you grow grow up a little, cuz. Okay, well they don't seem like they're the best of friends. Uh. Oh, there was a weed there. The advantage of accidentally plucking weeds. I go to the city. I mean, we can't buy flowers safe. Hey, maybe we can get our shoes shine. I should have also checked uh, the Able Sisters before going. I keep forgetting to check there because I got into the habit of not going to the Able Sisters in Wild World. Because, well, there weren't really any outfits I liked. <laughs> Yar, welcome aboard. And welcome aboard to your hair too. Ain't that a style for the ages? Might you be aiming to get your photo taken for one of old, oh them, you know, street fashion magazines. It's a fine goal, Sprat. Don't let anyone tell you different. Nothing wrong with a bit of strutting. Believe me, before you know it, you'll be buttoned up and boring and wondering where the fashions be. Nah, but forget it, the city be coming into the sight. Keep bus fare in one pocket and with the rest and, and with the rest of your cash. Move boldly, Sprat. Spend as much as you want and don't you dare regret it. Captain has some really good life advice. Like <laughs> Is that biscuit? I think that's biscuit. It's another animal I know of because of uh, Trekker Conroy's Let's Play. Biscuit is pretty cool. He's food obsessed and has no pupils. Where the heck are all the restaurants around here? But no restaurants means no shortcake. <laughs> hey, can we get another thing from Phineas? 
Why, hello there. And what could I do for you this fine day, little boy? Uh, give me something. Okay, settle down now. I'm sure I've got just the thing for you. Now don't be shy, just tell me which prize you want, and it's yours. We already have a bubble wand, so... Bunny balloon! Ah, looking for a bunny balloon. Can't say I blame you, I'm a sucker for those cute guys too. Let's see here, no, wrong color. Aha, here you go, Sonny! Yeah, with these, there's actually a bunch of different colors. Keep a tight grip on that balloon. Rabbits have a way of getting away from you, you know. And we can now... Pull out a balloon! And we have a blue one! Oh, I love the blue ones! Oh, I love this. Wait! Maple! We know her! I never noticed when I'm walking around back home, but my shoes are filthy. You know what I need? A shoe shine. Oh, she's just... Maple! Do you say anything else? Walked around too much, now my shoes are all dirty. As long as I'm here, I figure I'll get my shoes shined clean before I go home, honey. Wait. Mint! It's just all of our old villagers. A shopping cart is a must-have item if you want to buy things in the city. I don't like to carry lots of bells around. It makes me feel... Okay, I, I missed that last word. A shopping cart? I have no idea what that is. Let's get our shoe shine. All right there, young sir. Fancy your shoe shine. It's 500 bells, and you'll see reflection in them. Please do. All right. One first class shine coming right up. Just tell me how you want your shoes. I can match them by color, or I can match them to the style you're going for. What'll it be? Match my style. What a choice. I got just the thing to match your style. This'll get your loafers glowing. He's like a shoe shining ninja, I love him. Oh, he's back to go back to red. And there we have it. What do you think? Pretty doggone dapper if I do say so myself. Now if you don't mind, that'll be 500 bells. And no tip necessary. Thanks for your patronage. You're welcome, Kicks. Ah, I love being here. Uh, but we came here for this, actually. Just notice every part of us is a different color now. Um... Hmm, yes, yes. Welcome to the auction house, my good man. Shame and heartache, but we are currently preparing for the next auction. The next display period will last for two days and begin March 24th. I'm gonna be of assistance. I want to display an item. Okay, can't display any more items. Next display period. Okay, so that's... Uh, what's today? Twenty So that's two days from now. I... I will figure out how this works. <laughs> Please, no one tell me. I wish to figure this out on my own. It's kind of how I do things in games. I rarely ever actually like having the game... Anyone or even the game tell me how to do something. Okay. Um... Hmm. Where's this, this little spot here? Um, and also, I had the time wrong. Um, these can be possibly moved after 8 p.m. So that means that there's a good chance on Saturdays that if we come here, they might be open. But we have checked what I wanted to come here to check. Um, hmm. You know, I'm gonna get my bubbles out, and I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna play with some bubbles around here. Bubbles! Bubbles! Th these animals don't seem to care. Wait, does this bunny not have a nose? Dotty! Someday I want to work in a city like this. Maybe I'll, like, open up a fur fro restaurant called Chowdown Halifax. And we'll have the hottest waiters in town. It'll be the perfect, it'll be perfect wee one. Fair enough. Now let's blow bubbles at the statue. Maybe the statue will love the bubbles. Um, okay, let's let's head home. Uh, no, not blow bubbles at the sign. Let's head home. Uh, <laughs> so convenient that you don't have to wait for specific times to take the bus. 
I guess they kind of realized that there's not a whole lot you can do in the town without a lot of money. So it's like, well, we might as well give them a way of just getting back and forth easily. Because they're going to be traveling back and forth. They're going to be, like, traveling to town for, like, their fortune and that's it. <laughs> or maybe just to hear cat moves. Yar there, ye wee tuna. What news ye got of the old city? Bustling as usual. Did ye see lots of kids? I be... I be through... I be... Tho or th through... Tho. Tough. Is it tough? I don't know English. There's so many... Uh, okay. I be tough, yar. But me heart... Heart muscles m melts when I see Tots out with the, with his, his folks. Them parents using every trick in the book to please this little guy, waving his chubby fists around. Yar, I know the feeling. I got myself a wee nephew. And ain't the sprat as cute as bean when he ain't yelling. Anyway, Halifax just be seconds away, sprat. Once you're home, get yourself into bed. Double quick, yar. Oh, and call your parents once in a while, you carp. I be sure they worry. Fair enough. Now we're back home. Um, not actually sh Well, we're gonna go check the Able Sisters. Maybe we can either find the pink helmet or the green shirt. Because <laughs> that's kind of what I'd like to find at the moment. Yeah, let's... Whoop, I didn't mean to talk to him, anyway. So, been, have, been having fun lately, cuz? If you want to get the scoop on anything major going on in town, be sure to talk to the gatekeepers. They always know who's coming and going, cuz. But let me save you the trouble. There's nothing huge going on right now. I just spoke with them. Fair enough. I'm gonna blow up some bubbles. Like bubbles? B bubbles? Bubbles? No, neither of them seem to care about bubbles. Well, let's talk to Fisty. Oh, if it isn't Steven. This must be like your big day out on the town, me me. Walking time, walking time. Time to get all fit and stuff, me me me. I just ate like 50 pounds of sponge cake, so I'm feeling kind of bloated. <laughs> that would make you feel kind of bloated, I guess. Let's hop into the Able Sisters here. Feels like with how long I've been waiting to record that this is going by really fast. Um, hmm. Is this just a shirt made of metal? It's a tin shirt. No, I don't think I really want that. Um, hmm. Well, maybe. It wouldn't really match the helmet, though. Oh, I'll, I'll just talk to the sable here. Um, Steven, is it? Hey, what gives, sis? You almost never recall a customer's name. Don't say things you don't need to, Mabel. Please feel free to take a look around. Don't mind us. Aw. She's opening up to us again. Yay. Thanks, you come back now. I might actually at some day soon try doing a night episode. Because there will probably be things at night we can catch and do that we just can't do throughout the day. Plus, it would give us a chance to check on uh, that thing behind the traffic cones. So. Um, well, yeah, we haven't really been over towards Town Hall. Is there anything you want the bulletin board? No. Okay, then. Um, hmm. I could, I could try again for bees. But I almost just don't want to try again for bees just yet. So I think I'm just gonna... Water yeah, I watered my turnip. Okay. And I'm just gonna head home here. Um... You know, I kind of want to move the trophy. I want to move the trophy to the corner here. There we go. How many gyroids can we have active? Apparently quite a few.
I think I found the way into Lyle's heart. It's just fill a room with gyroids. Because, I mean, he loves gyroids. So, you know. He's gonna... No. Well, no, oh, dear lord. I hate to get that on screen. Spin you around. Pull you out one as well. Actually, let's have them face this other one. There we go. Yo, know, I need to quiet through these down. This one's barely making noise. That's why I can't hear it. Okay. I was trying to figure out what noise that one was making, but it's barely making any. And this one's just like raving it up in the corner. It's perfect for the corner. Um. Hmm. We could probably put our bunny. Blue away. Wait. I think C means cyan, so that's literally the, my like favorite color of blue. Fair enough. Let's let's put our our, bl our blunny balloon. Yes, blunny, bunny balloon away. And I think we're only gonna get our umbrella out when we're gonna go to the city, just in case it's raining. But let us come up here and hop into our bed. And with that, I thank you all very much for watching, and hope to see you again next time for more Animal Crossing City Folk. See you all then.